are true. Well, people are pouring into the Birmingham Waterworks Board right now where a public hearing is set to begin in just a few minutes about a possible rate increase. And that's where Alan Collins is right now. Alan. Janet, we are expecting an overflow crowd here at the Birmingham Waterworks Board headquarters. They've brought in extra chairs out into the hallways and TV monitors to handle that crowd. I can tell you also, extra security also will be on hand. We're basically talking about a 3% increase they're looking at going to. That comes out to about an average of $1.54 a month on your bill. Well, for some, they still say that's too much. Thursday, people continued to flow into the Water Board's payment center to pay their water bills. News that the Water Board is looking at a 2.9% increase did not go over well. It's going to hurt a whole lot of people. The 3% more is going to hurt a whole lot of people. Everybody can't afford no 3% more. The Water Board looked at an almost 4% increase, but they were able to trim it back to the lower amount. You know, we have about 4,000 miles of main in the ground. That's aging, aging infrastructure. So trying to keep up with that, we've seen a lot of leaks lately. We have to keep those things going in order to maintain a, a strong system. Jackson says the excessive rainfall hurt. It meant less lawns were being watered, and that cut back on the Water Board's profits. If we didn't raise the rates at all this year, not saying for a fact, but there is a strong possibility that next year going into the, when we plan for the budget for 2019, that rate increase could be significantly higher. Former state lawmaker Paul DeMarco has been a critic of the Water Board, and he pushed for expanding the Board of Directors. DeMarco says another group, such as the Public Service Commission, should be overseeing the Board and to determine if the rate increase is needed or not. Come in and regulate the Water Board and say, if you need these rate increases, you need to justify why you need to have these annual rate increases. Now, the Water Board just okayed a rate increase that took effect last January. That's about